Liberal Viewer presents. So I was starting to page through all the evidence the grand jury looked at when deciding not to charge Officer Darren Wilson for killing unarmed black teenager Michael Brown, which was helpfully uploaded to St. Louis Public Radio's website, and I was watching the pretty biased Fox News coverage in the background when I heard Fox News anchor Megyn Kelly come up with this gem. It all comes just hours after President Obama acknowledges emotions are running high while also appealing for calm. And the very moment he says that is the very moment violence really starts to erupt in Ferguson. Watch this. There are issues in which the law too often feels as if it is being applied in a discriminatory fashion. I don't think that's the norm. I don't think that's true for the majority of communities or the vast majority of law enforcement officials, but these are real issues. And we have to lift them up and not deny them or try to tamp them down. What we need to do is to understand them and figure out how do we make more progress. And that can be done. That won't be done by throwing bottles. That won't be done by smashing car windows. Uh, that won't be done by using this as an excuse uh, to vandalize property, and it certainly won't be done by hurting anybody. Uh, so uh, to those in Ferguson, uh, there are ways of channeling your concerns constructively, and there are ways of channeling your concerns destructively. It's unbelievable, is it not? <laughs> Unbelievable is right, but I want to know what you believe. Was Fox News trying to blame President Obama for the outbreak of violence, or was Fox News only trying to shame him for not preventing it? And on the bigger question, how did you react to the St. Louis grand jury's decision not to charge Officer Darren Wilson for killing unarmed black teenager Michael Brown? I YouTube, you decide.